Hi, it's Mariga here from Skin Essentials and I'm back to you with a really quick um, FAQ today where you send the questions and I hopefully provide the answers. And today's question um, is very simple and it was, Mariga, what is the best age to start an anti-aging routine? So, um, you are never too young is the answer there. Age, aging prevention, you can't prevent aging. Preventing the visible signs of aging from taking up residence on your face is what we're talking about really. So the younger you are and if you have um, you know, children, teenagers, adolescents, uh, I know that you're all very good at putting sunscreen on your children these days which is absolutely fantastic, that's where it all starts. Um, but encouraging your teens to do the same, keep sunscreen on year round, use it as part of the skincare routine, that is the absolute number one. Um, if it's a little bit too late, you're gone beyond that. Into your 20s, um, mid 20s is definitely time. If you've had no skin issues up to now, you would have gotten away with a good cleanser, a nighttime moisturizer, and a daytime SPF. Moving through your 20s is time to start adding in serums. Um, if you have no issues at all, something very basic like our essential nutrient serum will just give your skin all of the nutrients it needs um, that are water soluble just to keep everything healthy and tip top and to keep your skin producing new skin cells and collagen and elastin and all of that as much as it possibly can. And then of course because um, that's just a water soluble for oil because our skin is lots of um, structures in our skin are made up of layers of oil and water you've got to give your skin the nutrients that are, are soluble in oil as well because everything's going to be one or the other. So that is the lipid repair concentrate. So I think that from our range, those are the two products that when you are moving through your 20s that you need to start in with. The essential nutrient serum will come first and then um, the lipid repair concentrate and essential nutrient serum onto your day cream, lipid repair concentrate onto your night cream. And if you are really invested and compliant in your skincare, that will keep you going right through, you know, well into your mid 30s at which point we can start to think about that the collagen will be declining a little bit more and we would replace, say, your essential nutrient serum with a collagen um, serum. So if you begin your anti-aging young, you will get away with murder. It will be years and years and years before you have to start doing anything. I have always looked after my skin. Um, I've always been obviously very interested in skincare and working in and around the skincare industry for nearly 30 years um, and it, it really does pay off, it does show. I am 45 now and one thing I never have to worry about is wrinkles. I'm starting to get a couple of little sunspots here and there, they very commonly do come out in your 40s and um, I don't care, I'll take them off with the cryo when they come to the surface and we'll start all over so that's fine. So never too young to start anti-aging, just to make sure that you are never using perfume, essential oils and sulfates in your products no matter what age you are, no matter what skin condition issue or type you are treating because they are three things that are guaranteed to accelerate aging long term on the skin. So if you're doing all that, you're eating reasonably well, I'd be very happy with you and you will be kicking um, anti-aging treatments down the line a lot further. As budget allows, have a facial every couple of months that's all going to stand to you in the long term. So thank you very much for the question. I love talking about anti-aging or pre-aging as we call it. So while we can and with great tools like microneeding and LED to reverse the signs of aging, to reverse these lines, cryo as I say, to take off the pigmentation patches, um, it is really, really nice to get people before that um, so that we can really work with you through the years and make sure that uh, you don't have to get to that for a very long time yet. So thanks for the question, thank you for watching, do subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you next time.